There'll be links below to this song so you can hear it in its entirety, mastered and finished. Also, please subscribe, click the like button if you like the video, and hit the notification button so we can let you know when more content is coming. Thanks. I have a kick submaster, a snare drum, tom tom, drums M, which stands for metal, which is overheads and cymbals, ambience for rooms and room samples, and then all the percussion is separated to different things. And you can see some of them have inactive plugins. I can activate anything that's ready to go at any time, and they're already assigned to their respective sidechains where I want them. I have my kick in and out mic, I have my kick sample, I have a kick ambient sample. I don't want to over-process everything. So normally what I do is I worry about phase aligning and I put my SSL channel strip on it and it feels like a compressor, behaves like a compressor. Then I send them to these subgroups and then I process them with some analog outboard. So on the kicks, I have a Tone Lux EQ. A snare, I have a Tone Lux EQ. Toms a pair, overheads a pair. Guitars, I have API 500s. And then some other things I have on here is uh, 1176 for the snare. I usually have one dedicated to the snare and the kick with a pull tech, but these sounded good. I just needed the one in the one spot. So you can see I have these aux subgroups for every instrument. Now that we've talked a little bit about the drum subgroup, let's dig in and take a listen to the drums and check them out. So I have show hide markers, basically his track visibility markers set up so I don't have to go moving up and down 100 tracks. Right there, I just clicked on my drums plus their side chains. So if I solo the audio of the drums, I could take a listen to those in the chorus. So there's not a ton going on on the individual drum tracks. I have this, which is the, one of the greatest things invented ever. It's the uh, Brainworks SSL-E. have one of those on every drum track, and I just work it like I would a console. And then I also have this Auto Align plugin. You can set a point source of one of them to be the master, and then everything else can phase align to that. Rather than just pushing the phase button and say, oh, the snare and the overheads, it's 180 degrees out of phase. This can not only adjust that, it can time align, and it can also adjust for out of phase that's not 180 degrees. So let's take a listen to the drums with the auto align in, and then we'll bypass. Out. In. So you can hear a change in the low end and how that's affected. So we don't really have a lot of reverb on the drums. On some of the ambient samples, we've added this reverb. It's a uh, slate reverb and it's the CLA snare, which is modeled after the Sony reverb. And then we have the 480 from Altaverb, which is really great. And then one of my favorite reverbs at any price, and it's only $50, is the Valhalla Vintage Verb. And, and this, can, this is, I think, we copied Tile Room from a PCM 70. So it's, it's really awesome. It's very reasonable. So let's take a quick listen to our individual drums. So here's our kick in and out. Kick sample. So that's um, a slate sample, the CLA samples. Here's the ambient kick sample, which is just the overhead and rooms of the dry kick samples blended to taste. Now here's all three together. Moving on to the snares, snare top and bottom, sounds nice, 
snare sample. This was a combination of the Ludwig Brass from CLA and the Brady snare, and I think that was a Blackbird sample. I'll put that together with the other snare. And I have ambient sample here, and this one is the same Ludwig brass, but more of the room. Here's all three together. And we're going to add the kicks. And I'm going to add the room mics. And the overheads and hat. So there's the drums. So that was The World is on Fire by Moguls of Mayhem, Anatomy of a Mix, number one. Hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe. Hit the notification button so we can let you know when we have more. Hope you stay healthy and well. Keep making music. Thanks.